let's 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 get about the business of helping each other. That's that's what this whole thing is about: building relationship and networking, and making sure something happens to each and every one of us. And so we need to use what we have. We need to use our relationships to help each other. It's a diverse world now. We are about diversity and inclusion, different thoughts, different views, different perspectives are accepted now. You know, change is this chance to get better, you know, better than we have been doing. When I think about ENC, I think about information capital residing in people and relationships that leverage profitability for business as well as social justice and networking to raise our communities. That's what I think about when I um, you know, think through all the uh, opportunities that ENC provides. ENC is a very special event where senior level executives uh, in the corporate community come out and that's what draws me out. You can attend a lot of events across the country uh, that don't have this level of senior executive participation. And so it's a unique experience uh, to have an opportunity that you wouldn't normally have uh, to speak with these individuals to help them come understand your value proposition and how you might be able to help them advance their business. Interaction, the networking, uh, the speakers that we had. Uh, the best way to build strong Contributing minority communities is by having strong minority businesses. So y'all in this room can be really powerful in understanding that the new economy that is there that is there for us for the taking if we wanted to and understanding that, you know, doesn't have to go the same way that the internet economy did. And this has been one of the, uh, I say one of the greatest programs that I've seen for a while. It's inspirational and motivational. Even in an economic downturn, as bad as things are, somebody is making money. Might as well be you. I learn every time I come here, I learn a lot. And I share my thinking and I learn about the thinking of others. I really want you to stop and think about where are the opportunities? So as you speak with people, to engage with them and understanding that you provide a solution. And that this is less about affirmative action, but it's more about competitive action. This conference brings together great people, great thinkers, people who are gonna actually implement this stuff. Coming to ENC and participating in it on a regular basis is important uh, because of the numbers of impressions that you'll have an opportunity uh, to gain with senior executives and corporations. When I look back on the things that I've learned last year and the things that I've learned this year, I'm so proud of the relationships that were developed and how they're going to propel me to be a competitive uh, member, a contributing member of society just like those that came before me. We have tribal leaders and executives in here and we have CEOs and we have risk takers called entrepreneurs. I challenge you and thank you for the work that you're doing. But today I ask that you continue to engage over the next two days to provide some kind of reasoning for coming here. And you cannot justify being here just by playing golf, right? Y'all work with me. You know, when you think about it, you know, you, we can reflect on how times have changed and we need to figure out ways to also have some generational conversations <clears throat> so that as we figure out how we move forward, we also have some clear understanding and context and framework for where we came from and how we got here. When you get a chance to reach out and help somebody, reach out and help them. That's what this is all about. That's what my life is all about. You cannot over-network. You cannot over-market. You cannot oversell your business, provided you have a good quality product, you're a credible business leader and a credible organization. And if for no other reason, we all can learn something from somewhere, someone else, no matter how long you've been in business. So this provides that kind of information. Well, the numerous words that I would use to describe this event and the Institute, phenomenal leadership, innovation, world class. This is powerful. This kind of conference is it's not a simple reunion to have fun. Phenomenal leadership. You always walk away feeling like, yes, you can do more and that there is a great opportunity out there. This is where people are making decisions for 10 years in advance. The most important thing about this 
event is that it really gets a group of like-minded people together you know, who see how their self-interest is tied up in advancing the economy of North Carolina. And I think that's a really powerful place to be for entrepreneurs and also those who just see that the future really is theirs for them to create.